but I've been doing like not a lot. So yesterday I kind of did this similar thing. So I'm just gonna go through. I'm just putting eyebrow stuff on, tinted moisturizer, Bare Minerals uh, tinted gel cream with just like a brush like this and curling my lashes and that's it. Like I already put moisturizer on, but I hate putting mascara on throughout the day. Like, cause I always rub my eyes. So I'm just gonna put on the brush and just dab it around and it gives me a tan look as well but it just like hides any redness and then I just gotta put some I use this Mayel brow kit and I just kind of fill it in and then curl my eyelashes and call it a day and that's all I'm gonna do this is so hard without a mirror. Literally calling it a day. I did put some like face mist spray the other night and it kind of like reached this but it didn't reach like this because I didn't mean to like spray it on my neck. It kind of just like fell over there. But this is what I use, Saint Tropez. Saint Tropez, sorry. Did I blend? Okay, San Tropez. Okay, is that better? It just, I don't even know if I blended right, so don't kill me about it, but it just gives a little bit of dewiness and I put some lip on too, just like a chapstick that's tinted. That's all I've been doing. If I had my hair done, it'd look like I'm done up a little bit more, but I'm just lazy today. My hair is super dirty and I wear this sweater like every single vlog. So that's my life. But we did do some more home decor stuff. We have some new furniture in and we just did some curtains yesterday. I should have vlogged it, but it was just one of those dates that like, you know, I wasn't in a good mood. I didn't want to fake it for the vlog and whatever. So, but I'm going to show you right now. We have new nightstands in the master and new curtains and I'm obsessed. There's Misha. But so basically, I put these curtains up. Well, my dad did yesterday. And I just feel like it looks like so much more homey. And like here if I come, it's like so aesthetically pleasing. For those curtains oh i'm obsessed and the new nightstands are from a crate and barrel and they're so nice because they have a usb port like inside there and a what's it called an outlet and then there's a plug that comes out of there so for the back but i got like an ivory color and i think it's so pretty how the light like shines through i just love it so we still have to do this one and I have, so I'm, so this is my outfit of the day. I have this thing on here because I'm shooting a wedding on Friday. And basically I'm just trying to get like everything together. So this is a hand grip because with the lens and the flash that I have on there, it's going to be super heavy. So <laughs> this is what I look like right now. I have to go to JCPenney today and get the rod for here. I have to return the one I got and actually like order it from Bed Bath. And then I have the curtains sitting in this room for these two, but I feel like I need to do two and two curtains because this is super thin. So if I just have one there, it's gonna look weird. So that's a bigger window. So I think I need two and two, but I also have to clean this mirror. I've been meaning to do that, but that's the update in the master. And this is the update. So here in the kitchen, we finally got our bar stools, which I'm obsessed with. They are like a leather top and then this like ashy wood color similar to the floor. So I'm obsessed with that. And I feel like that's it. <laughs> But look at all this stuff I have like getting ready for this wedding. Like this is the bag I'm taking. I have memory cards, batteries for the flash. I have all these batteries for the camera. This is like the 
cool flash I'll be using. And then this is the lens I got, the 20, no, 24 to 70 lens. And then a backup camera. I'm charging that backup camera's battery. And then here we have like all the rest of the wedding stuff. So this whiteboard for flat lays, that tray, like fabric, and then all this stuff. I'm just keeping here. I need to clean this, but yeah. Um, she has a little bear sitting up there. That's Friday. Today's Sunday, so I have a couple days left. I'm a little nervous, but hopefully everything will go well. Maybe if I put a bang up front, it makes me look less like a boy. Okay, that's a little bit better. Okay, now the skin looks way better. This lighting is way better than it was earlier. So I returned the stuff. I'm not gonna get it for a while, which stinks, so I can't finish that other window, but also, like, my dad was helping me put it up and Colin doesn't. He's like, I'm not gonna help you put it up because I didn't want him in the first place. And I was like, you're a dick. So um, I have to wait for my dad to come help me put him up. Oh yeah, so it's been my last video, two videos before this was a huge life decision or whatever. And that was me going on this like new health process. It's not really a diet. I don't really know what to explain, how to explain it. Um, also Colin's pulling these ivy out and he's coming this way and I really don't want him to ask me to help. But so it's been two and a half weeks since that video and guess what? I've already lost an inch on my stomach and an inch on my hips. So it's working. I'm doing 80% eating good, 20% eating whatever I want. So typically it's like weekends, I'll eat whatever I want. Like yesterday we made burgers and in and out fries. We also bought a grill which let me insert the footage there it was a feat and that's probably after we got the grill yesterday that's probably why i just couldn't even get my energy up to vlog because it was just so stressful we went to home depot we were going to order a grill they were going to assemble it two days later and then we pick it up but turns out they had hi misha are you watching mama they had the grill that was on display and we could take that home and it was on sale too so we're, it had a little bit of scratches colin didn't care and i was like whatever so we got to take that one home so that means yesterday we had to rent the home depot truck and put it in the truck and then like i needed and colin had to ask a neighbor to like help it help him bring it down because i didn't know i can i don't think i could have picked that thing up like People helped him put it up at Home Depot, but then when we got home, we needed someone to take it down. So we were grilling yesterday with my parents. We made these In-N-Out fries, which I have a TikTok on how I make them. Um, it's so good, so good. And yeah, that's what we did yesterday. And then we started putting up the blinds, like all of a sudden, spur of the moment. I was like, my parents are here. My dad always helps me with these things. Let, I've always wanted to get curtains up there and I was like, let's just do it. So we went and then today I think I'm gonna just edit a vlog, probably the one right before this one. I want to get my memory cards all ready and format all my memory cards to make sure there's a lot of room on there and all of that. I just hope I have enough batteries. If I don't, it'll be iPhone photos. I mean, I have a ton of batteries, but I know that the Canon M50, which I'm gonna be using, that batteries go so fast so we will see i ordered dining room table that should come in november and the dining room chairs i just ordered a couple days ago and that will come i think in october or november so i'm really excited about those two purchases and then ideally i do want curtains like at these windows next to the fireplace so maybe eventually i can convince colin but we'll see. I'm gonna get to editing a vlog and then we'll see where the day takes us. You guys, look at the background. I'm back at my parents' house. All my vlogs used to be like standing right here or right by the window. I look pale as ever. I forgot my bronzer, but I'm on my way to shoot my first wedding. It is a favor for a friend and we'll see how it goes. I have like, look at this. I've got the biggest backpack and it weighs so much with all the stuff. I don't even know how I'm supposed to like carry this the entire time on my back. But I'm bringing a sweater because it's gonna get colder out and wedding card and all of that. Let's see how this goes. I'll try to like do some updates, but I don't know. I think I'm gonna be like losing my mind. Okay, we'll see ya. Bye. <laughs> Hello. 
Okay, I'm back. I don't even know the last thing I filmed. It's been probably several days, but I'm actually all showered, ready to go. We're heading to Miami tomorrow. Just a quick couple day trip, just me and Colin. We decided to just do something domestic. We were gonna maybe do like an all-inclusive because I actually had a coworker go and she was like, all the precautions, all the safety precautions were being met. She had an amazing time. I wanna give back to the tourist places. There's a lot of different people that think different things and that's fine. But we are going to Miami. I'm all packed and ready to go. We got the little suitcase over there with the hat. Got my big bag, did my nails at home today. And I just have, I just took some chicken out of the fridge because I wanna make sure the fridge is clean when we come back and we don't have like mold and stuff. So I'm just gonna clean this. We're headed to my parents' house for the night to sleep from there and leave from there because Misha's got to get babysat. So she'll be with Rudy for a couple days and then the airport is actually closer to their house anyway. So it actually works out. But yeah, I think I'm going to end the vlog here. I don't know what's in this one. I hope it was a good one. <laughs> I need to like do... I like to just like film random things in my life, but... I am thinking about doing more specific videos, but I don't know what I would want to do it of yet. I know a lot of the home reno stuff really took off on TikTok, so maybe that would be helpful for people. Like, thing, 10 things that I would have done differently for my home reno or something, you know? So I'm gonna start thinking about that maybe, but I need to get to this chicken, and I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Oh, I have to talk to you guys about the wedding. The wedding went so good. I was literally so sore the next day. I could not move. I woke up like 20 times that night because my 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 like collarbone was sore and every time I moved, I'd wake up because it was just like excruciating pain. So the next morning I took like three Advils because I literally cannot move. So now it's like two days later or something and I feel like definitely better. I'm not as sore, but like my arms, my calves, like everything. Oh, and I got these new jeans I have to show you guys. So I did a haul on my Instagram. These cute jeans. I love them. I mean, sometimes I look frumpy because I'm short and when I wear baggy stuff like that, you know, it's not that flattering, but they're just so comfy that I don't care. I got them from H&M, so I'll link them if you want. Check out my Instagram to see the pictures. I was really surprised by some of the ones I got. Like, I was really pleased with the photography I got. There are things that I still want to work on because obviously this was my first wedding ever. Um, her brother, the bride's brother actually, asked me a couple months ago, hey, would you shoot our wedding in May? And I said, wait, let's wait until we see like how Jenna's wedding goes and then we'll talk about it. So after he saw them, he's like, okay, yeah, can you do ours too? So now in May, I have another one, but like, I don't know if I would want this to be my only thing. I think it's fun to do like here and there. So that's my two cents on that. Yeah, okay, so we'll see you in the next vlog. The next one will be all about Miami probably. So bye. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.